and welcome back to me doing a reaction thing to uh the dragons the nine realms today i'll be checking out episode 12 and 13 um yeah so last episode was fun honestly probably the best episode i've seen honestly it has been like almost the second best episode i've seen so far in the show but things are getting better um I feel like now that we actually know, like I, I said it before, now that we know the characters, we know the universe, um, you know, a bunch of kids with dragons, we're going to meet different dragons, and, and the dragons are going to have different abilities or whatever, yada stuff, yada yada, right? Um, I mean, I don't know. Um, what else could you do with this? I mean, I, it could get old quick. So in the next two episodes, I, I don't know how refreshing things are going to be. You know, like, how long are you going to keep dragons hidden from the adults or, or Icarus? Um, when are we going to see uh, Leonard again? Balshar, you know? <laughs> and when are we going to get a dragon antagonist as well? You know? All right, so let's just not dilly-dally. Let's just jump in and let's do the reaction. Let's go. All right, let's uh, do this. Uh, I forgot to also mention that this is also a two-parter episode, so, um, what could it possibly be about? Stealth. Yeah, it was all stealth. Oh my god, he's like my least favorite character in this show. The worst. Uh, Eugene. Mama? Mommy? All right, she's long gone. I wonder if he follows them to find his own dragon. Interesting. Wait, what are the odds? I I, I love her perception of this. Like, what, what, at all the you gonna you gonna write with me? Hmm. Dragon Club. Yo, don't be telling another dragon what to do. It's not your dragon. He's trying to hate him. Oh my god, kid, shut up. Like, just listen to them. Doesn't explain why they lost service. Don't you think maybe you should write on Plowhorn now since, you know, she's taking the lead? Yeah, yeah, good idea, Alice. <laughs> okay, let's move. Wow. She's like, yeah, I don't want this guy on my dragon. I love, I love Alex for this. <laughs> God, if you just get off the dragon, you can walk faster. I mean, yeah, it, why not? It's a freaking two-headed dragon. Why didn't he think of that? What a brilliant person. <laughs> Look how this case playing freaking Sherlock Holmes over here. Well, since you know everything that goes on around here, do you know where he likes to play? No. I mean, 
I love how this guy just does not listen to anybody. You know, here I thought Tom was my least favorite character. Now it's Pete. Rats, Are you kidding me? So they're like fire spiders. I love it. Like, how can it, you know, how can you be so cute? The deadly. Oh, poor little feisty dragons. I can't believe I ever fell for your cuteness. <laughs> well, I've had about enough excitement for one decade. Not with Alex. We should head back. At this point, we don't even know if we're still on Thunder's trail. You're right, Tong. First it was the terrors and the bubble forts. Whatever this place is, it's getting yeah. Dangerous. No, the guys. Look, they're still lightning on the right. You don't even know what it's for. Yeah, there's no safe points. Wow, it has nothing to do with them, but yet, but yet they're using their dragon to get you. No. Yeah. <gasps> wow. Wow, what a dick. Bruh, I'm. I'll be done. I'm like, I right, sure. You can stay. But I would, I would just turn back. I'm like, I'm, bro, you want to be on your own? Go ahead. Nah, no, nope, nope. Not with that that attitude that he he said did. <laughs> What the hell's going on there? Are you serious? Stick to the walls and get around it? What? Or this is like when you're like under level and you're trying to like explore in an RPG dungeon. You're gonna go try to fight a dragon that looks a hundred times stronger than you. My Jesus. The phone keeps going off. I don't feel like he's about to die. It doesn't stop the freaking tornado, dude. What? Impossible. I think so. Do you know what day it is? Tomorrow morning. I'm just messing with you guys. It's Saturday. That day. I hope your Viking helped us work on this course. Thunder. Thunder. Okay. Have they actually found them? Thunder scales? No. The 
last contract was winning. All right, here we go. This is uh, the part two ness. Interesting that Thunder left here to fight another electric dragon. Maybe it's part of its family heritage. Like, I feel like this is a big, huge plot point here in the show. Hey, where you going, buddy? Come back. I love the fact that they're being brutally honest about that because he was being a jerk. And I forget Eugene is still trying to find his sister. Yeah, I kind of like her, you know. With a chupacabra? I'm just saying, there's always something in the center of things. Like corn? Like corn. You know, watch it be a girl dragon that looks exactly like Thunder. Watch it. Watch it. So predictable. What the hell are they doing, Scooby Doo here? Do really? You know what is lightning weak against? Like what? Brown water, maybe? You know, I was thinking the same thing. I'm like, this kid is on an electric dragon. He's gonna get sapped. Oh, I love how he just walked it off. Like it didn't even hurt him. Oh, lost the tablet. Now you're screwed. Oh, and they're separated. What is going on here? Alex. I think both of them are so selfish. The thunder brought Tom far away to save him, but what about the other kids? That's so cruel. Is that really a smart idea? That's so unfair. Oh, that's a really good spot in a way. <laughs> she's pretty much telling you boundaries bro don't touch <laughs> revenge you're the one that went all out of your way to get here Thunder! 
What are you doing? You, what does he want to fight? Hmm. Very disobedient dragon. I wonder if this fight is gonna. Wow. I wonder if this fight's gonna end in a draw. Or like, hey, we gotta escape. We'll fight him again another time. Or maybe Thunder will actually defeat this thing. I wish it was a little bit more established, man. I feel like this fight was rushed. See, if we had actually other episodes of seeing them fight other dragons, I mean, be it that we did, but we really haven't gotten that much contacts on their abilities and skills. Well, we shouldn't look at her diary. <laughs> what? So my guy chose a place where his attacks get absorbed. Not a smart place to be. Like he's like, oh, if we don't try that, we don't know. So when I die, it's okay. Try something else. Is he gonna like stab him? What? I've got the power. How is that not hurting him? Cause all you did was just make a hole for that dragon to escape now. Really? Ow. Okay, subtle. See, I knew it. Wow, look, an even more What? I guess my better questions would be because tom found thunder just flying randomly right uh obviously the icarus people were digging a hole and there was dragons trapped inside this mountain cave cliffs whatever but they've probably been there for centuries right um who's to say that maybe there are other humans still inside there i mean that would be weird you know like what trapped these dragons inside there i mean i don't know again i haven't really watched the movies yet to deduce this so i'm gonna continue to watch the show without watching the movies as yet it was a really fun episode but i feel like man i wish there was a little bit more ambience a little bit more um history between thunder and this antagonist of a dragon right but be it now i feel like it's been building onto it because uh what this is the end of season two and we're you know we're gonna jump already to season three and I feel like we we already built up Boss Saw and this dragon here, right? So um, eventually either they don't necessarily have to fight again, you know, 
but it could be in the background someday like watching and then it'll show up and be like hey i haven't forgotten bro and then leave again be it I don't know. I just I I like stuff like that because it just it builds on that like ooh they're gonna fight, bro. You know who go with who go with who go with. I don't know. It sounds silly, but sure. Or I mean I didn't even think about it because obviously this the the, sh the stick of the show is to figure out Tom's heritage and Thunder's family dra or dragon family. But who's to say that the next season? It wouldn't be the other kids elemental villain of the month you know what i mean like what if um you know the angelo's dragon you know he gets a an antagonist or um alex or he, june right that would be interesting as well i actually i would prefer that um so then when we eventually get to the finale of the show um you know we get a quick Hey, this is the story. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> All right, that about does it for my videos. Always let me hear your thoughts in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think of, you know, Dragons and Nine Realms. Uh, so leave any feedback down below. Uh, make sure you like the video. Subscribe if you're new here. Uh, check out the Patreon for full reactions. Like today's video will definitely be up there. And uh, always, God bless you. I'll see you soon. Bye.